singles that's coming your way. And Wang Tzu Wei, who surprised so many yesterday by seeing off Victor Axelson, will now take on Kun Lovat Vititsan in the quarterfinals, a number eight seed from Thailand. Look at that men's singles draw. And of course, uh, four semi-final places up for grabs. Two Chinese players in the mix. The rest all from different nations, as you see there. And the winner of the Wang Vititsan match will play either Singapore's Lo Kien Yu or India's Lakshya Sen in the semis. Then in awaiting in the final would be the likes of Shi Yu Chi or Anders Antonsen. But that's uh, still a couple of days away. It's about Salut getting through the hurdle at hand. There is a man who thrilled many players. last night, but also caused plenty of tears for all the Axels and supporters. Wang Tzu Wei of Chinese Taipei. The giant killer for sure. At this tournament, leads the current world champion onto the court, Kunlabut Vititsan. There he is. And this will be certainly a battle that puts experience of Wang up against the youth and exuberance of uh, Vititsan. At just 22 years of age, seems to have played plenty of badminton already. Wang Suwe, of course, now 29. Still going strong. This is their sixth meeting. And Vititsan leads that head-to-head 5-zip. -head the last meeting was at the Indonesia Masters this year, and Vititsan won that in straight games. Thank you. So Vititsan winning the toss, choosing to receive which means Wang Su Wei will serve, but he's held on to the far end of the court. Yep, at the Indonesia Masters in the first round this year, Vititsan won 21-13, 21-16. Before that, they met at the World Championships last year in the quarterfinals, and Vititsan had to win that in three, 18-21, 21-15, 21-13. As I mentioned, 29 years of age from Taipei. He's ranked 27th in the world but has broken into the top 10. That was in February of 2021. Has a win-loss record of three wins to five losses this year. That's 37%. Not the best start to the year, but given the way he's performed here, I'd say that you can't read too much into, that, into those past performances. Quarterfinal win-loss stands at 0 to 1. So he's had one quarterfinal loss. And look at that. That tells you the kind of giant killing form he's in. Beat Jonathan Christie, the defending champion in the first round in three games, 12-21, 23-21, 21-17, and then a straight games win to knock out the world number one, Victor Axelson, in 37 minutes. Now, that has been some amazing badminton on display from Wang Tzu Wei. Kunlavut Vititsan, 22, from Bangkok, Thailand. He's ranked eighth in the world at the moment, has gone up as high as three, which was in June of 2023. And has a win-loss record of five to three this year at 62%. The quarterfinals, he's won nothing in quarterfinals. He, of course, uh, played at the Indonesia Masters last, where he lost in the semi-finals, and that's where he got that quarter-final win. Beat Brian Yang in 82-minute encounter, 21-13, 13-21, 22-20, -13, and then another three-gamer against Lin Chun Yi in the second round, 68 minutes that lasted. Well, he is known to be the king of three-gamers. Him and Kodai Naroka have uh, created a reputation of sorts for themselves. We see the umpire for this match is Trish Grubb, joined by Sudeep Barve of India in the service judges chair. Yeah, so even though Kunlovat Vititsan has spent a lot of time on the courts already, I don't think that will affect him in any way. He is known to play those three games. 
for some time now, so he's probably physically prepared for another three-game battle. So this year, semi-final exit at Indonesia Masters, where he lost to Anders Antonsen in straight games. But he got that quarter-final loss, uh, win against Kieran George in two. Then second round exits at right, India and button. Malaysia Vitesan, this year for Vitesan. And on my left, Wang Shuhui, Chinese Taipei. <laughs> Wang Shuhui to serve, love all, play. Here we go, Wang Suwei will serve Out. to get this quarter-final underway service and uh, makes a service error Love. to begin with. Last play of the German Open and retired in the first round against Nat Nguyen. Coming back from injury here at the French. Lovely backhand flick. Two. Love. Has one quarter-final appearance this year. That was at the India Open where he lost to HS Pranoy in three games and then first round exits in Malaysia and Indonesia. That's been the story so far, but the performance here has been short of unbelievable so far for Wang Tsui. It just shows the quality of this player. So over. One, two. Superb. Two, four. Seemed to have landed Change. weirdly there. Wang Suwei has a little bit of a wobble. Yep. You see him just limp off a bit there, but nice strong smash to make it two all. for Wang Suwei will be whether he has enough in the tank to see this match through. Especially should it go to three. It's gone long. Service over. Well, apart from the World three. Championships last Four. year, they also met at the Japan Open and the Singapore Open, both in the first round. Richard Sarden winning both encounters. And then the first meeting was at the Thomas & Huber Cup 2020 in the group stages, and Richard Sarden won that in straights. Oh. out. Five, four. We'll find his range pretty quickly here, Vitted Sun. Oh, mistake. Service over. Unfortunately from one in the net, looking four. for the net roll. Lower the shuttle Five. to get that angle. Change. He kept it pretty low there, yeah. Made it hard for Wang to defend. Uh, 
that's gone wrong. It's good pressure from Wang Suwei at the moment. Over. Just Six. All. staying in touch with Vititsan with every point. Oh. He knows the pressure is on Vititsan to deliver. Again, mixing Seven, it up over. very well from Seven, six. slightly shorter, slower, and that exchange. A quick injection of pace into that smash there. Was the longest rally so far, and it's Wang Su Wei who comes out on top of that. Seven, four. 27 shots. Wang Su Wei. On court. Stayed with Vidyatan throughout that rally. Huge on confidence at the moment. Nice type of player. Great defending from Richard Sun. Oh. Ability to mix it up. And just when he sees that those smashes are coming back, he just changes his shot style. And he's slowly but surely Seven, making over. his way up Eight. towards the net with its on. His lists are coming at pretty nice heights as well, I'd have to say, for Vititsan to eventually put away. Ooh. Lost his footing there. Nine. Gonna play eight. the net lift. Excellent rally. Oh, he makes the mistake at the net in the end, but he was controlling such a large part of that rally, Wang Tsui. That was a superb shot, the cross court forehand. Further back. And then just falls short of the net. Two-point lead. Players ready. Whoa! That's better. Service over. Nine, ten. Again, jumps on that one. 
with the body shot. Makes it 10 all. Does have that ability to change the pace of his shots quickly. Kun Lovat Vijitsan just about Eight holds four. on here at 11.10 at the mid-game break. Having uh, taken the lead at 5-4, he was pushed all the way, but will be relieved to be ahead at the break. Mistake of the net by Wang. And so we've had... 10 minutes of play, and it's Vitit Sun who's a point ahead. And it's Vichitsan who leads 11-10. Couldn't get to it once away. Sixth French Open appearance for him. Hasn't gotten past the second round before, so this is his best showing. First time in the quarterfinal. Made his debut back in 2015. Did not play last year, though. 13-10. Compare that to Vititsan, who's making his fourth French Open appearance. Debuting back in 2021 when he exited in the first round, but it's his third straight quarterfinal appearance. That's bang on the line. 14, 10. Really precise. What? Yeah, he was watching the shuttle all the way through. He couldn't have placed it better if he wanted to with it, son. Service over. So showing he too. Has the ability 14. to find those spaces, those tight corners. It's his third quarterfinal appearance here at the French Open, but it's son. Hasn't gotten past the quarterfinal before. So looking to break new ground here. Yeah. Effortless. On the backhand, over. finds the 15, winner. 11. Line judge. Pushing Wang Sui on the back with the clears and with the steeper forehand. Brilliant variety in that rally from Vitid Sun. Thank you. So in 2022, he lost in the quarterfinals to Rasmus Gemke. That was in three games. Last year, he withdrew from the quarterfinals against Ang Ziyong with injury. He was struggling with his back, you remember, on and off. He withdrew from the quarterfinals of the French Open last year, which was held in Rennes, of course. Still going. 
And in the end, 15, Wang Suwei gets stuck in the mid quarters. Vititsan just nudges the shuttle to the front corner. It's a lovely bit of skill there. been one way traffic in the second half. Ten after ten all. But it's on has won six of the last seven points. Seven of the last eight I should say. In. It's on the line. Service over. 12, 17. Wong, shuffle. injection of pace aims it at his body actually very close to his body so uses that kind of loose lift from Vititsan at the net to his advantage Consistent enough at the moment, Wang Suwei. Maximum points he's strung together in the second half has been two. This entire game has been three. He's not been able to go on a run. Much. Over. 14, 18. Suwei so just strapping around him. You know he's body has taken a toll from those last two matches. Too late. 19, 14. Once away. Oh. I was surprised at how quickly the shuttle dropped. Good defensive shot there on the backhand from the Titsan. Lift and Service runs away, over. makes no mistake. Pounces on it at 15, the net. 19. And we can't afford to give easy shots like that one. He was looking to take it late. But it was the length that was, sorry, the height that was misjudged, really. Wangsui's best spell yet. 
towel only. One Five of the last only. seven points have gone his way. has gone off the boil a little bit. A lot more errors now. He's making it a little too close for comfort for himself. Oh, so frustration for Wang away with that 20. shot because... Game point. It sets up three game point opportunities for Vititsan. Changes. Oh, he missed it. Looking for the smash. Over. Just think that he's limping a little bit 18, here once away. 20. If you just see the way he moves there. And cut out. Defended. Oh, yes, hey. that time. It was the perfect First snap. Game, by and it's Kunlovat Vititsan who prevails in this opening game. 21 18. It got pretty close at the end there. As Wang Suwei made up a fair bit of ground, going on a three-point run. Kunlovut had enough of a cushion to see him through. And ends it in style, 21-18, after 22 minutes. <音><音><音><音><音><音><音><音><音><音> นักมือการออกลูกระดับลูกมีอะไรมันมีแตกต่างกันไหมมีเย็นนะใส่ใจมากฟอร์มดีเรามันยังกล้าเราไม่ได้เคยเจอแล้วเรามาคาดหวังม
He's got a 5 nothing head-to-head record. Oh! That won't mean much Service given over. Wang Subei's recent form. He One beat Axelson for the first time yesterday in his career. You can certainly see off Kunla Vititsan if he wanted to as well, I'm sure of that. It's whether he... can continue against all the odds. Service over. One all. Once we hasn't gotten to a quarter final since so he hasn't won a quarterfinal since the Korea Masters last year. And consistency in his season has been preventing him from being on the top of his game. Two, one. Kunla Rajasthan's last title came at the Thailand Open last year. Also last year that of course he won the world championship and given that it's an Olympic year and there will be no world championship this year he'll get to hold on to that world championship title for an extra year and the benefits of winning the world championships before the Olympics or the year before the Olympics get to hold on to it for two years oh he missed it three one Dinner, but look over. at the way he lands Two, every time three. he lands from a jump shot. Wang Suwei just feels like he's walking off an injury. Oh. Limp there. Yeah. Whether he's playing with some kind of injury. Wouldn't want to give up this opportunity where he's seeing his best, some of his best Three. badminton, oh. understandably. It's we all now. in the first game as well where it was just about staying ahead for Richard Sun. Wang Suwei took the lead a couple of times but overall as long as Richard Sun was ahead didn't matter by how many points as such he thought that he was more in control of the game as a result oh, oh that's a beauty that is an absolute beauty he made it look too oh. easy. Wang away on the backhand. A no look backhand cross court winner. It sounds like a mouthful, but that's what it is. And again. Five, four. The skill level on display is. Change. Extremely impressive and because he makes it look effortless. Just a slight nudge here and there, flick of the wrist. Doesn't look like he's having to 
exert too much energy playing those shots. Oh, what is this net exchange? Six. That was four. super tight. Right there, the net shot, then he sends a cross net and then he sends it back. In the end, it pr proved to be a little too tight for Vititsan to respond to. A two-point lead for Wang Suwei. I think it's the first time in the match that Wang Suwei leads by two. Off there. Wang. Just, the movement is not 100%. Oh, oh he missed it fully. Seven, Looking over, for the down the line seven, smash. Five. Which it's on. Um, only. The rare mistake. Towel only. Where he completely misses it. Thank you. We edge closer to the mid-game break. Oh ho! It landed on the line. Nine, five. How good was that? One, shut it. He had a response to Kundavut's net shot. He's ready for it and then finds the back line. And again, look at that. Ten, and suddenly, Wang Suwei has a hold of this game. It's a five point lead. Four points in a row for the Chinese Taipei Shuttler. Oh. Service over. Six. Ten. Good thought out point by Kun Lavut sending the shuttle behind Wang Suwei. That leaves the court wide open. Careful here, Wang. Built himself a nice little lead. Doesn't want to give Mitutsan any kind of looking. That was pure pace Eight, on the forehand ten. from Mitutsan.
both players a little bit more cautious in this rally. Maybe the other one would make the mistake. The longer it goes. It is runs away. Nine, ten. Who fails to get enough height on that net shot? 42 shots that rally. It was a lovely cross net from Vititsan. He makes it a one point game, more importantly. on here, Wang Tsui at the mid-game break, 11-9. He's done well to stay ahead of the world champion. Nice little smash to close out the point. And so, it's a 29-year-old who's up by two against the eighth seed after 14 minutes. Trish grew up reminding them 11, that they need to hurry up getting back on court. Wang Suwei continuing with uh, trying to keep Vidditsan on his toes. Yeah, that was wide open to put so away. It it's a loose return from Wang Suwei. 10, 12. Missed it. 11, 12. One point game now. It's fallen on 12. the line. Oh. Much to his disappointment. But he's doing well with it's on to move Wang Sui around the way he is. He knows he'd be able to create more space on that. Wang Sui has Wang challenged that. Hold in. in.
It is indeed in. So an unsuccessful challenge for Wang Chu Wei. And Kunla Wood takes the lead. For the first time in the second half. Come back from 9-12 down. Well to defend it and Wang Sui as well. Let's get some spin on that backhand. And still going. Titsan's trying very hard to keep Wangs away towards the back court. Because he's been pretty strong in the mid and front court area. That time it's gone out. Service over. 13 all. Change. Question from Chris Grubb about whether Kun Lovett is breathing, and I think he is on his right knee, on the bottom of his right knee. So she's called for medical assistance. He's been defending the shots from pretty low on the court. Surprised that he's picked up a graze. <laughs> Wiping the blood off the cord as well. Break will do to Wang Suwei. Oh, he's beating on his finger as well. Scrape all parts of their body. They use it to defend. Way he was a little bit of momentum. He saw that lead disappear from 12 9 up. He then is trailing 12 13 and just leveled at 13 all. Maybe the break will do him some good to reset. Doctors have finished attending to visit Sun and we'll get this game quickly underway. <laughs> 13 all Vitit Sun with the first game in the bag.
to the top of the tape, but lands across. Oh, he missed that time. You can see the way he's walking. The fact that he's not able to consistently deliver winners is what's costing him this game so far. Yeah, there you go. Body shots. Left couldn't have it stranded in the mid-court. Missed it again. That time it was Kunlovat Vititsan. And it's called out. He's challenged it. It is indeed out. It's in fact well out. And so one to A. Now two points ahead. 16, 14, play. He did well to defend the smash, but then so on the follow-up. Monks away just 15, 16. Couldn't find the back line. Defense, though. That is superb. He's still going. Kunlovut was smashing his way through that point. And Wang Suwei defended for his life. But in the end, Kunlovut had had enough, I guess. 16 all. Five points will decide the fate of Wang Suwei. Five to win and push this to a third for Wang. Five to win for Vititsan to book his place in the semi final. Yeah. Great drop shot. Superb. Just a little 17, jump at the net 16. and gets the drop. Really nice. Takes the lead. An important time here with its son. behind Wang there. Yeah, that opens up the court when he 18, sends Wang, 16. especially trying to play him on the backhand. Three points away now is Vititsan. Yeah. Oh, 
he was quick to react there. I thought that was over. Let's land it in. Misjudgment. <laughs> 19, it's good to see him smile, though. There's nothing that can be done about that. He thought it was going out. Instead, lands in. He's watching that shuttle like a hawk. So Kunlovar Vititsan sets up four match point opportunities. He's gone on a six point run. And now a chance here for a semi-final berth. Ooh, hesitation from Vititsan. Still going on. Rangs away will not give up. Standing tall still. Okay. It has indeed landed out, and uh, Kunlabut Vititsan converts on his first match point opportunity. That's 21 18, 21 16 in the second game. Wang Suray, though, gave it his all. Up and until that last Kunlubur point, Kunlubur he Kunlubur kept Kunlubur playing, 18, making Vititsan work as hard as possible to find that winner. In the end, though, it proved a little too much. He sends the backhand long. And it's the world champion who's through to the semi-final for the first time here at the French Open. His first semi-final in four appearances. 21-18, 21-16 in 51 minutes. It's Kunlavad Vrititsan who's through.
four matches done. We're down to our fifth match of the morning session. This is the final match of the morning session. Men's doubles coming your way. Satrik Sai Rajranka Reddy and Chirag Shetty. The world number ones will take on Supak Jumko and Kitinupong Kedrin of Thailand in the quarterfinal. Of course, Ranka Reddy and Shetty are not only the world number ones, but former champions here at the French Open as well. The winner of that match will take on the world champions, Kang Min Hyuk and Seo Sung Jui in the semi-finals and the other semi-finals to be decided in the bottom half of the draw in the evening session today. The likes of Alfian Ardianto, Hoki Kabayashi and Astrup and Rasmussen 